hey lovelies welcome back to my channel it's been a while i know and i keep saying it's been a while but it has been a while like i keep posting a video and then i disappear i'm gonna try to be consistent y'all i promise i'm gonna try to be consistent okay so in today's video we are making fried chicken i've done this plenty of times but in this video i'm not the one who's making it my mom is okay so this is her version yeah so yes we're making fried chicken let's get into Okay, so first things first, wash the chicken, which I didn't show because that's something obvious. And then it was a full chicken, so she cut it into pieces first. Yeah. Then when she was done with the cutting, she washed the chicken again because salmonella people. And then now when it comes to the spices, y'all, you just keep on adding until you're satisfied, okay? There's no measurement. Yeah, until you think it's, it's good enough and you can always add more when cooking, you feel me? Okay, so as y'all can tell, we used like plenty of different spices, but then it helps with the flavor. Like it's chicken. I feel like without proper seasoning, chicken tastes like shit. So yeah, the most is ending the better. Yeah. Okay, now for the for the for the coating, it's flour. I don't know if it matters which type of flour you use. I don't know. Okay, so it's flour, and then all the same seasonings I added when boiling the chicken is the same seasonings that we put in the flour, and then you mix it up so that you know that the spices in the flour properly you know and then now for the eggs some people don't use eggs i don't know what they use but i use eggs um for it to stick here we only use two eggs but you know the number of eggs used depends on the amount of chicken you have you know and again same seasonings as in the chicken because i, f I don't know because you know the coating needs to have that say that the flavor Okay, so here's what the chicken looked like after it was boiled. I think we boiled it for like about 10 minutes or so, I'm not sure. Until it's cooked. Usually when I make it, I don't boil the chicken first, but yeah, she, she decided to boil the chicken first. It didn't really make much of a difference or anything. It just reduces your, the time you fry the chicken because it's already cooked, which is different from when you fry it without cooking it, you feel me? Now you dip it in the egg first, put it in the flour, and then same thing with this one you do the same okay yeah, so the that the secret in the coating the thickness of the coating is in how many times you redo the process for us we did it twice because yeah you could do it more. I've never tried it more than twice. For me, two more, dipping it two times gives the perfect crust. Yeah, so you redo the process, put it in the egg again, and then in the flour. And then we made sure to do that with all the chicken. Now when it comes to the amount of oil you put in, that depends on you. You could put in a lot that it's, the chicken gets fully covered or you could just put in a small amount like here. You see, and the oil should be really, really hot. And then when it starts to, I don't know, those those sides <laughs> when it becomes hot down there. And then that's when you, you start flipping it. Yeah, just when it's like that. But then you keep flipping until it's proper. You see. 
just when it starts to crust up you flip it so that the other side can get crust up as well and then now you see what it looks like it's all crispy on all sides but you keep flipping it until it's the golden color you want okay And by the way, y'all, notice how it's not oily. Can you see, like, there's no oil in there. It's like a slightly healthier version of KFC. <laughs> you know I, mean? I wanted y'all to feel the crispiness, but yeah, I had to remove the sound because people in this house don't stop talking. But anyways, look at how juicy it is on the inside. It's not dry. And again, I wanted to show that it's crispy, but yeah, it is what it is. Okay, so that is it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it. Because I enjoyed the food. I mean, like, I'm, I'm taking this video, like, days after I ate that beer, but I still remember it was a banger, okay? I liked it. If you want to try it, do try it. You know, I don't put measurements, y'all, because I am black. We use the eyes, you know, until we just pour until it's enough. So, yes, I hope you do try it. And let me know if you like it, okay? Until next time, bye.